Today I'd like to show you Nepenthe zacriana. There's two nice plants here in the nurseries in 12 inch pots. We'll take a good look at them. And also I'll tell you a little bit about the history of this species. And Nepenthe zacriana is a name that could be new to some people, I think. But if I mention Nepenthes fusca, that's a much more familiar name. This particular item here, we marketed for more than 20 years as Nepenthes fusca. And we knew that Nepenthes fusca was quite variable. There's a form from Saba, from the Crocker range in Saba. And there's another form from Sarawak, which is very different. So some years ago, they were split into two subspecies. And then subsequently, if I recall, in about um, 2019, I think, they were elevated to species. So Nepenthes fusca was then split into two distinct species, Nepenthes zacriana, which was the fusca from the Crocker range in Saba, and the Sarawak fusca, as we used to call it, was then uh, named as Nepenthes dactylifera. So if you happen to have this plant in your collection, and you might, because we have sold in the last 20 or 25 years, um, tens of thousands of them. This is a single clone selected from what we used to call Nepenthes fusca Crocker range. And you need to change your labels now to Nepenthes zacriana. Same plant, different labels. So that's a little bit of the history. Nepenthes dactylifera is um, another one we'll show in a video sometime soon. So moving around the plants here, just to show you these two plants, they're in 12 inch diameter pots. It looks look a lot bigger than 12 inches because of the enormous tuffets of moss. You can see the pot there underneath. The plants themselves are growing in a mixture of choir fiber and chips, which is what we use for nearly all our Nepenthes. And they've nestled in here, they love the moss. So let's have a look around the side of this plant here. There's another lovely picture just nestled into the moss, looking very comfortable. There we are. They're very tough pictures, by the way, very hard and woody. The thing with the pensies is if they have tough pictures, the pictures generally last a long time, uh, though they will take longer to form. So there's a trade off there. Soft pictured plants. Well, the pictures form quickly but then they can also die off quickly if conditions aren't quite right, all other things being equal. So these pictures will last a long time. Not a particularly fast growing species, but not bad. Relatively easy to grow, I'd say sort of intermediate difficulty. This plant's vining, there's no uppers on this uh, plant at this particular point to show you. Just going back to the first plant here, and the first picture we looked at, just hanging here, looking very graceful. There we go. So that's a first look on video for us anyway. First time we've shown this on video of Nepenthes zacriana, formerly known as Nepenthes fusca, Rocker Range. 